there is a general view that the dust that formed the solar nebula and afterwards the solar system was homogeneous and well mixed. Now we have here Hypatia, which is a gift that keeps on giving. Uh, we see uh, particles in it that have not been seen elsewhere in the solar system. Rather than looking at all the anomalies that this thing presents, we have been wanting to explore if there is an underlying unity, if there is some kind of a consistent uh, chemical pattern in this stone. And we did find it using the proton microprobe in Somerset West. It is a consistent pattern of trace elements, but very, very different from anything in the solar system, very different from carbonaceous chondrites, ordinary chondrites, etc. We cannot compare it with anything in the solar system. We have been looking at uh, the average composition of dust in, uh, let's say, our arm of the uh, galaxy, that is the solar neighborhood, as it is called. Uh, there is no similarity, no full similarity there either. This is Hypatia's pattern is different. The only thing that we found that is similar to the pattern of Hypatia, and it's no perfect match, but it's the only thing that is similar, that is the material that is uh, spewed out into interstellar space by one particular kind of supernova 1A ex explosion. And um, uh, whether that is the ultimate answer or not, what it does show is that individual parcels of dust uh, can actually be incorporated in the solar nebula as it formed without being fully mixed and homogenized with the rest.